Welcome to this special here on Reckless Eating. Matt Zion along with Chris Reckless. Here, move over a little bit. Move over just a little bit more. What if I kept telling you until you just were off camera? Let's so, get on to the show. We did a munch pack a little while ago. They sent us a free dealio in order to basically promote it. And uh, they're going to do it again. They were pleased with our video and they asked if we wanted to do this. So Ooh. go ahead and click down in the description for the link to munch pack. If you, this is interesting to you, this is like basically one of those services where they, once a month they send you a pack of random food. You don't know what you're going to get. It's all surprise. And there's a lot of people I know that actually do use this service. And this much pack was made just for you by Sam. Oh, thanks, Sam. Thank you, Sam. Thank you, Sam. All right, so we're going to go buy this. We're going to try to go buy it really quick. Oh, it's Japanese stuff. We're going to do this a little different since there's so many things in here. We're just going to say whether or not we're glad that that munch pack sent this to us or not. So it's going to be like a fan package, essentially. No ratings. Got it. Uh, this one is ETI Grax. <laughs> Ooh, it's like it looks like crackers. It's pocky and like cheese pocky Ooh, kind of is what it looks I'm like. I'm actually very excited about this. Yeah, this should be good. Ah, I love pocky. It's the same concept. It just Make doesn't it. have any chocolate on it, which is fine sometimes. All right, let's try it. <laughs> it's a little bland. Yeah. It's a little bland. I kind of wish, I wish that it had some like cheese to dip it in or something. Me too. There's not enough cheese. Mm -hmm. I don't, you know, I would say I don't think I'm glad I tried this one. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna eat this. It's I don't like, really like it. One thing it tastes like exactly like this cord cardboard right here. We're gonna say pass or don't pass. I don't don't pass on that. Don't pass. It wasn't good. Mm -mm. I guess it would be. Would it be we'd be passing on it? No, don't pass. It didn't pass. That's what we're sticking to. That. These are gonna be amazing. Um, from Vidal gummy turtles. Yeah. That tastes, tastes like nail polish. Watch. I don't think so. These are foreign. So foreign gummies. They care about their people. <laughs> <laughs> Marty, we gotta go back. He's getting old. Yes. <clears throat> I think he said he had to go back and he says he's a little bit shaky about it. <laughs> he's more shaky than Michael J. Fox. <laughs> oh, he smell like, well, he smell weird. Oh? It, yeah, I don't, it's like a cream, like a cream soda smell. It does, let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> mm. It is like a cream soda gummy. Mm hmm. Mm. That center. The texture is amazing yeah. on this thing. Oh, that is good mm -hmm. stuff. That is some good stuff. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. I am glad that it gets a pass. I am glad that you sent it here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. I've never had a gummy like that before. Remember that video? Mm hmm. <laughs> turtle having sex with a shoe. Oh, it was a sandal. The Coldplay one. Oh, yeah, yeah. But it was the same thing. It was turtle having sex with a sandal. Mm hmm. Oh, this is going to suck. Uh, we actually did this on main show four, mm -hmm. way back in the day. Uh, this is tamarind candy. And this is the exact same brand that we did back then too. Hated it. But maybe because that was years and years ago, maybe we'll like it now. I see. Maybe your taste buds have changed. That was back when we thought like the smallest thing was gross. See, my girlfriend loves tamarind because she's Mexican. Well, yeah, but, but you're, you're white though, so you wouldn't. I'm redneck, yeah. Yeah, you're white, 100%. Yep, 100% white. Caucasian. White powder. Where'd that come from? That's a good movie though. Powder. White Powder? Yeah. Powder is a good movie. But well, you know the director is a child molester? After oh, horrible movie then. Yep. Horrible movie now. I can't get yep. this open. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's done everything in its power. Wow. Life one mad zero. Life one mad zero. It hates me. How is it? Is it better? I don't know. I'm waiting for you. <laughs> oh, I thought you are. I, I'm being courteous. Okay. You're being courteous, Axel? I'm being courteous. Oh, Whoa, oh, that's right. He still wrestles, huh? He's still a thing. Wow, what I happened can't. to him? And even Damien Mizdow, what happened to him? Where did Damien Mizdow go? Oh, uh, he was getting over, so they had to they had to put an end to that. Oh, yeah. If you think about it, I, here, while I'm trying to get this over, let, let me rant about that real quick. Uh, Anybody's a wrestling fan, sorry. So, he got over with Miz, right? Him and Miz was the most over he's been in a while, too. Because, like, he'll heat. So, he gets over. What do they do? immediately drop the angle and bury the sh mm -hmm. why like what both of them are doing nothing now i can't <laughs> i don't know understand why they keep them maybe because they don't fire anybody anymore like they keep people unless they do something really really mm -hmm. messed up <laughs> all right i'm just gonna lick it <laughs> I can't go. here uh -uh. no actually that's a lot better than i remember well, how easy that was <laughs> Your fingernails are disgusting. Oh, because I got off work, you idiot. 
Wash your hand. Work. I do. It just gets under the nails. You gotta wash your nails. That is way better than I remember mm -hmm. it being. I remember back then we like spit it out and super yeah. gross. That was before we had tried some of the worst things mm -hmm. on the planet. I'm glad they sent it. Yeah, that's fine. I, I think I actually think it's mm -hmm. it's fine. I'm glad it's a pass. All right. Hot wasabi peas. I'm wasabi actually, coated peas. I'm actually looking forward to this. Really? Because you don't like anything hot. Uh, I like you. I'm very attractive. <laughs> Why won't you let me touch it? Go away. I thought you were confident enough. I'm not. No, right. Right. Today, I don't feel good about my body. Oh. I woke up and I saw a few uh, extra Here's fat smudges. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Oh. Oh. Mm. Wow. Well, we got a kick. Mm hmm. Okay, so the heat, definitely, of course, the wasabi heat. Yeah. The peas taste fine. The heat is the champion of this. The one thing I do like, it doesn't go down your nostrils. It does not. So the heat, it does really, it's strong, but wasabi that goes down your nostrils is, a, is an experience. Wow, that one's stuck. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is actually pretty good. I actually enjoyed it because it only lasts for like two seconds, the heat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, they're, they're really good. I'm glad we got them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm glad we got it too. Let's move on now. I've done this, but you haven't. Oh, I already ate those already. Taki All right, well, we're doing it again. Takis Zombie. Uh, you can click right there for our uh, our challenge. Actually, oh, there we go. Got it open. All right. I remember I did not really like these that much when mm. I tried them the first time. I thought that they were a little odd. Maybe it'll be different. Woo! -hoo. Guacamole. Yeah. They're good. They're good. I think I like them more than I liked them last time. <laughs> They got a spice to mm. them. I hate cucumbers. I really do. That just tastes like guacamole dip to me. Mm -mm. They're okay. <coughs> I'm, I'm, I'm so happy they sent them. I am. I think it's good. No. Thank you for sending it. That was a good one. Nope. Okay. Uh, might as well do this because we've probably done this before as well. Pocky green tea. And I love all kinds of Pocky. All right, Pocky green tea. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't like green tea at all, but in this form on Pocky, it's pretty good. It's mixing really weird with the Takis Zombie though. Well, he's trying something. I am glad that you sent this. This is good stuff. Pocky, mm -hmm. Pocky you never go wrong with Pocky. No, Pockies are good. Except mm -hmm. for add more peas to them. Some of the best Pocky I had was from Japan and it was the uh, banana Pocky. Mmm. That was really tasty. All right, this one just says <laughs> Rama and it has no English. This is, uh, looks like it's Russian. Is my guess. Okay. That's what it looks like. I think it's Russian. It is Russian. Russia. Mother Russia. I think what they took is just bird seeds and they meshed them together. Alright. Break that off. Let's do this. Oh. Mm. What the hell is that? It tastes like cardboard. Remember, remember, remember that cereal smacks? Yeah. It tastes like that, but without the sweetness. It's the bitter. <laughs> it's like a dark chocolate no. smacks. Oh. No. That's no. gross. I had the worst thing so far. Oh. That you swallow and you like it. All right. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it's lingering. That's it. In Russia, that's right. treat. That is. That's <laughs> treat. All right. This is... There's no English on it. I don't know. Actually, it's from... Uh, it's produced in New York, but they didn't put any English on it, which is very strange. It's some sort of like lemon cracker is what it looks like. Like a lime cracker. Why is it produced in New York but has no English? That's so that's weird. But they distribute to other countries. Yeah, but usually this kind of stuff is made over there because it's cheaper to make it over there because the states have, you know, <laughs> labor laws and <laughs> things that protect others. I think it tastes better when it's made by a child. Oh yeah, that's, uh, that's lime. I hate it. It's like lemon lime. I hate it. I don't know. It's not terrible. I actually think it has an interesting flavor. It's like a rich cracker with like a lemon lime. It's lemon cheese. I'm glad that they sent it. I like it. That's definitely lemon cheese. I like it. I'm glad. What do you say? And it has MSG. I'm okay with that. I don't like it. All right. So you give it a no? Yeah. Uh, let's do this next. We're going to have to bite this in half. Japanese style mochi mango. Ooh. Mm. I like mochi. I hate mochi. I love mochi. I hate it. It sounds like a kid's TV show. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to say it with my mouth. 
I'm gonna zoom in on that and that's gonna be like a new like instant viral clip of <laughs> badass tries to eat mochi and fails. <laughs> you should have done a sad face right after you. Oh. Um, I hate the thing with mochi is the flavor is always good. I hate the texture. I love the texture. I'm a big fan of the mochi. It's like, it's like <laughs> mush. I like the mush. The Steven mochi. Oh, ooh, I like Steven mochi. <laughs> I did not like that. I'm, I'm, I'm unhappy that it was said. I'm very happy with it. All right, we have two items left. Uh, let's save, let's save the known one for last. Uh, this is green, or garlic green peas. Ooh, it looks like it's Japan. All right. Oh God, the mochi is gross. How do you know it's Japan? Is that right? It could be Chinese. Mm, I'm starting to get the difference. Starting to get the difference. They do They do have their own distinct difference. I just had to look because people make fun of me so often for not knowing. <laughs> All right, there we go. <laughs> no. Mm -hmm. The best part is the hint of garlic. It just tastes like dry nothing. I like it. I don't like that. I am not glad that that was sick. <laughs> I'm happy about that one. So far, there's been more happy than not. I feel like we're gonna go out with a bang though. Keebler soft batch chocolate chip cookie. Mm, it looks like they're uh, they're facing off against Chips Ahoy. So this is like a soft version of their, their stuff. They've always been making that type of cookie, dude. No, no, Keebler hasn't. Yeah, they have. No, Keebler's the first time ever. No, I had this since I I talked out. to Tom Hanks this morning. We actually had an in-depth conversation about it. Here we go. Oh, the best. Oh my god, it's so good. Yeah. <laughs> These are always the best. It tastes like a cookie dough before you cook it. Mm -hmm. Cookie dough before you cook it with uh, chocolate chips. Oh, so good. Oh, it's awesome. Why do you have to check the ingredients like every time? Just to make sure there's no MSG, bro. So yeah, overall, good stuff. It's a fun package, I think, for, like for us, I've, I've seen a lot of this stuff. Mm -hmm. But I also go to every single store in the vicinity. I go to all the markets, Asian markets, everything. For somebody that doesn't do that and is curious about stuff that we try on the show, this is a great item because you're gonna get all that stuff without having to know where to look. I think so yeah, it's good stuff. I like it, it's a good concept. I like just having the randomness, what's coming out of that box and just trying it. I think it's just more of the adventure of what's gonna be, mm -hmm. what you're trying in the box. There's some things you recognize, some things you don't recognize, and some things that you never, never ever tried and buy at a store when you see it. And now you kind of have to since it's right here in your hands. And it's not like the video game one I was getting once a month where it would be like, I'd keep like one item. Like one thing was cool out of the entire thing and yeah. they would send a shirt. And I'm like, I asked for double XL, right? Mm -hmm. Cause I'm fat and I admit it and I want a comfortable shirt. And every time it was the Target brand double XL. So it would fit like Tom perfectly. And so it was like thin t-shirts. Oh, I like the thin ones. Yeah. but. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that. If you want uh, the Munch Pack, go ahead and click down below in the description for the link to their website to sign up. Yeah, thank you for sending this to us. We appreciate it. Maybe we'll do some business with you in the future. Mm -hmm. We'll see you on the next one. Reckless eating! Reckless eating!